Detectives called her a serial scam artist. Her latest racket, police say she pretended to be married to a firefighter and got people to donate thousands of dollars to help him. Investigators in Orange County got involved after people started complaining on social media. And police say the woman has a history of pulling alleged scams to make a quick buck. Kate Kelly and Stacey Butler is live tonight in San Clemente with the details. Stacey. Yeah, those who say they've been victimized by Ashley Bemis call her a ticking time bomb waiting to explode. And that moment may now have come now that sheriff's detectives have served a search warrant on her, saying that she built thousands of dollars from people who just wanted to help firefighters battling the holy fire. I'm just in shock. That's that's all I can say is pure shock. When Shaylee Florentino and her mom Sandy Summers watched Ashley Bemis and her mom carry in load after load of drinks, snacks, and supplies into their San Juan Capistrano apartment, the two share with Bemis's brother. I just thought they went shopping, but they shopped all the time. <laughs> Every day we saw them loading everything in the in the house. These neighbors had no idea the sheriff's detectives say Bemis was running an elaborate con posing as the wife of a fictitious Cal Fire firefighter on Facebook. She posted a call for donations like drinks, food, baby items, beds for firefighters battling the holy fire. All these kind hearted people are opening up their hearts. I mean, the firemen are out on the line fighting this incredible fire and they want to help. Um, and she prayed on that. Only after detectives say she collected the donated items at drop off locations throughout South County, San Clemente residents on Facebook took notice. They warned people to stop donating. They posted these photos of what they call other schemes Bemis pulled off. Take a look at this picture of a baby shower acquaintances threw her after she told them she lost her husband and other children in a horrific car crash. Sheriff's deputies confirmed that Bemis pretended to be pregnant, even using a fake baby. Bump. She even had these photos taken. Then there are these pictures. Facebook friends say she posted pretending to be the birth mother of the children she was only nannying. Detectives served a search warrant on her apartment and garages. They found at least $11,000 in donated items. In some cases, uh, people would just go to Walmart and spend five to $800 and buy goods and drop them off. And to Texas believes there are a lot more victims out there, either people who donated money or other items, or possibly people who even bought some of the items that maybe she sold online. If you have any information, the sheriff's department would like to hear from you. That's the very latest from San Clemente. Back to you guys in the studio. All right.